Elon Musk's possible use of illegal drugs is causing concern for bosses within his companies, according to a Wall Street Journal report. Allegations made against Elon Musk over possible drug use are worrying executives within his companies, a report in the Wall Street Journal, WSJ, has suggested. Musk, chief executive officer of Tesla and SpaceX, has denied the claims, insisting no trace of drugs or alcohol has been found in his body during random tests over three years. The allegations followed a recent SpaceX meeting when, the report said, an executive described Musk as nonsensical, unhinged, and cringeworthy after the chief executive officer turned up nearly an hour late, rambling and slurring his words. According to the report, Linda Johnson Rice, a former Tesla board member, decided against re-election because of her worries about Musk's drug use and unpredictable behavior. Sources familiar with the allegations over possible drug use said the claims referred to drugs including LSD, cocaine, ecstasy, and ketamine. According to WSJ's report, Musk's alleged drug use poses a risk to approximately 900 billion, 1 trillion dollars in assets, 13,000 jobs, and the U.S. space program. Previously, Musk admitted to using ketamine to treat depression. In 2018, he smoked marijuana during a Joe Rogan Experience podcast, leading to issues with NASA. After the episode, NASA required SpaceX to commit to federal workplace drug guidelines and allocate $4.6 million, $5 million, for employee training. Some of Tesla's board members have even wondered if Musk might have been under the influence of drugs when he tweeted in 2018 about taking the company private. The tweet shocked shareholders and triggered an investigation, which resulted in $37 million, $40 million in penalties, and led to Musk temporarily stepping down from his chairman role at Tesla. In response to the WSJ report, Musk's lawyer, Alex Spiro, confirmed that Musk had never failed a drug test. He criticized the report for citing false facts without specifying them.